So you probably, you're, 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 in, you're basically in charge of the science park. And, and my question to you is, what do organizational structures like this, what will, be, what will they do going forward to sort of foster this entrepreneurial talent in Hong Kong? Yes, our biggest part of what we are doing every day uh, has been using the incubation program plus the acceleration program to uh, get the startups going through a program to make them a bit more sustainable mm. uh, and uh, passing through what we call valid of death. Mm -hmm. So the first few years, we always coined them as the most difficult time yeah. uh, when they uh, start from the inception of the concept all the way to a point that they can be self-sustainable. Yeah. So through this program, we, we put in a lot of thoughts and bring in a lot of expertise such as mentors, uh, industry specialists, connect them with um, a lot of um, uh, possible partners and also uh, potential users mm -hmm. and give them a lot of feedback on how they can build their business, um, not just technology strain, uh, very strong, but also uh, uh, commercially viable. How does that environment in Hong Kong look compared to six years ago now? Oh, uh, totally um, uh, progress in a very um, uh, healthy way. Um, six years ago, for example, uh, the number of applicants uh, going into our incubation program and today has been quadrupled. Wow. And our capacity of, of um, um, qualified uh, startups coming to our program is also tripled. Mm -hmm. uh, that means from both quantity and quality, we have seen tremendous growth. Yeah. So I imagine when, when you're trying to fulfill every startup's vision and you're trying to be responsive to everything that you need, that they need. Yep. You must have to make hard decisions, though, about which industries actually you should face and what you should focus on. Where is that? Where does that line up in Hong Kong? Well, in a sense, we don't make a lot of um, uh, efforts in in differentiating which sectors they should be doing. Mm. Uh, we we try to let the market decide, uh, and also try to let the startups decide which area they would go in. We just provide a platform. Mm -hmm. um, to to uh, make them a bit more sustainable going through that process. Mm -hmm. But of course, we are seeing that uh, a, a few of the uh, areas that are um, a bit more um, concentrated and a bit more um, uh, popular. And we would put in specific uh, focus to assist those um, uh, companies in that concentration mm. um, with a bit more tailor-made uh, programs. Yeah. For example, in the last two years, the app's development has been um, uh, rocket uh, uh, skyping. Mm -hmm. and, and we bring in uh, partners such as Google, Amazon, uh, Samsung, uh, even um, uh, uh, companies from, from Tencent, uh, from mm -hmm. Alibaba, and try to help them along the way of how they can bring their apps to the global scene and also into mainland China. Yeah, and, and so just looking at it a bit bigger then, like looking at the Asia region, yes. I think there's something over four billion people mm. in just the Asia region and the number of smartphones is almost nearly that. Yes. Do you think that uh, you know, five years from now or three years from now even, the focus will be even more intensely on mobile applications in the cloud, or, or where do you see that going? Yes, this is uh, no doubt would be the, the definite trend. Uh, everything would be going mobile. Mm -hmm. And the mobile technology today is a bit more like a control. Mm -hmm. And a lot of the computing power will be mostly sent to the cloud mm -hmm. where they have a lot more analytical power and uh, computing power. And the big data age is coming. Mm -hmm. And so we need a lot of uh, computing power through the, the cloud computing. Yeah. And that's why the mobile become a bit more interesting that you can do many, many more things using um, uh, mobile apps. Yeah. And that trend is uh, already started. Well, I look forward to it. And is there anything, any way that people can get in touch with you if they want to come to Science Park and actually want to do some of their work there? Absolutely. We actually uh, put all our program on our web. And so it would be great to just um, uh, visit our web page okay. and, and contact the, us. The address there. is? What's the uh, URL? is hkstp.org. Got it. Thank yep. you very much for joining us. You're most welcome. It. Okay. All right. Thank you.